a while back we uh, we made some crushed ice now this is the reason why I did it I want to I want to freeze the neck of some champagne homemade well it's not champagne is it homemade fizzy wine and here it is here's some of the bottles I've had them stored upside down for some time now and I'm expecting them corks to uh, to want to come out but in the the hollow corks in the hollow cork is the must from the wine as it's been completing its fermentation in the in the sealed bottle but first what we have to do we've got our crushed ice and we've got some ordinary table salt and we're going to put some of that in there I don't have any much I need because I'm not very scientific and we mix it all up okay and then we put our bottle next day in amongst that make sure it's all packed around and there you go and now that should stand for I'm guessing four or five minutes and it should be frozen but in the true style we've got one here that we've done already and I can see that it's already frozen inside so I should be able to turn that up now and hopefully the must won't fall back into the into the mix and it hasn't done so quick as a whip I've got to take the cork off and hope it don't go flying off all over the place <sighs> nicely wired on and there you go <laughs> and I guess that with all the ice has come the must we let that eat gently and oh there's still ice in the bottle there we go voila now then we didn't hardly lose anything out of that and in here I've got some corks that have been in warm water there we go we wire that back on again and we've done the business